I was at this club called the Speakeasy. Speakeasy was the um, uh, uh, was where all the artists would uh, come together, where you could literally listen to each other's albums, uh, just having dinner. It was a wonderful place. It was a coffin at the front, and the, the wall would swing around, and suddenly you were in this incredible club. It was amazing. And the first person I met when we walked in the door was Otis Redding. Oh, wow. Then it was Pete Townsend and Keith Moon, who became a very good friend of mine. And through the glass were the Beatles. And this guy says, Scotch and Coke, isn't it? And I turn around and it's John. And I, ah. No, if he'd have said cyanide, I'd have drank it. I mean, <laughs> it didn't matter. And I thought, okay, yeah, sure. And I never drank a Scotch and Coke before. He led me on my road to alcoholism. <laughs> but it was incredible. And I didn't give it, it tasted awful, but I didn't care. And I became part of that inner circle.